herbal medicines, for example, and they claim that because it can cure everything, it has no side effects, they overdo it. Naturally, it's going to lead to some adverse effect in the body. In the same with, uh, way with a lot of the drugs that are prescribed by doctors. I and mean, if you take overdose of paracetamol, you're going to die, and so on and so forth. So I, I think the information out there is based on ignorance, basically. That's the word I'll use. Ignorance in the sense that um, the mere fact that somebody presents a kidney problem, presents a cardiac problem, presents a hepatic problem, and then maybe during interrogation, interrogation I mean the consultation, the person says, oh, I was treating myself with herbal medicines. It doesn't necessarily mean the herbal medicine is what caused that. It doesn't mean that herbal medicine cannot cause that. It can, but it depends on what other things the person has done. Was a person taking some over-the-counter medications, for example? That is possible. So there are a lot of confounding variables. And not until we can see scientific proof in the literature, which says that overconsumption of health medicines over prolonged periods is what is causing these problems. I mean, as a scientist, I will not accept that. Wow, wow. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank very, you much. very much for You're your welcome. time. Okay.